I finally got a bigger kiln. Well, I've had it for a while, but I was finally able to move it in and run it for the first time. So let's do our very first kiln pack and unpack in this big beauty. I had to clean it up and prepare the kiln shelf so it was ready to go. I then played around with packing it. This is going to take a bit of getting used to. I know how to pack my baby kiln to get the most efficiency out of the space, but this is a whole new learning curve about how the heat moves and changes in this kiln, even what pieces should go where in the kiln to get the best results. I filled it up and popped it on to find out it actually couldn't reach the temperature I had set it to. As you can see here, it says not done, meaning the kiln turned itself off after trying for a long period of time to get to temp. This means my elements need adjusting to get the right power for different stages of the firing. Thankfully, it did reach a temperature I need for my works as I always set my kiln a little higher. Not a total disaster, but just some adjusting. I don't think the serotonin of unloading so much colorful artworks will get old in this new kiln. I am in love. 